Joining me now from the OpenStack Summit in Berlin is Henrik Blixt, who is Product Line Manager at VMware. Henrik, thanks for joining us on Telecom TV. Thanks for having me. Now, your presentation at the summit here in Berlin, um, you spoke about why service providers are in love with OpenStack. Yep. What makes it such a good fit for CSPs? They're really excited about OpenStack for, for several reasons. One is that you know, they, they've been kind of struggling for a while with you know, replacing and, and trying to figure out how to, to virtualize their, their, their networks. Because uh, a lot of them have, they have old hardware that you know, specialized for, for you know, the network features they have now. And they want to get away from that and, and get to, to a place where they can virtualize all, all this infrastructure they have. And, and OpenStack is a really good, really good fit for that. So when CSPs um, deploy OpenStack, uh, what, what are some of the, the, the challenges that they, they, they run into? One of the issues is, 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 is scale and, and distributed deployments, because by nature of, of being a telco, their, their deployments are distributed because you know, they have networks that span countries or even the, even the globe. Um, and, and OpenStack, at least initially, was not really designed to be deployed at that large scale. So, so being able to deploy at these large scales, being able to manage those massive deployments you know, is, is, is one of the issues they're, they're facing. So what are the solutions available to them to, to overcome these difficulties? OpenStack, of course, is, is, is one of them. And you know, having these, these standard APIs that OpenStack provides is, is one of the ways they, that, that helps them do that, because then you know, get, they, they get a unified interface to deploy these, these uh, applications. They, when they integrate the orchestration uh, solutions or orchestrators, um, it gets a lot easier to test it and use it because you know, it's this, this one API that looks the same no, no, no matter what OpenStack distribution you, you use. So tell me more about the importance um, to CSPs of day two operations. Yeah, so, so that, some of that comes back to what I just said about these, this massive scale, right? Because if you have, if you're a small, small enterprise, you have, you know, 10 hosts in, in basically in your basement somewhere, managing that, not, not a big deal. You have thousands of hosts across, you know, 50 different countries. Just, you, you can't have, you know, someone doing hands-on for all of that. You need to, to automate a lot of that. So that's where being able to do uh, as much automation, do predictive analysis to make sure you, you get some help with, with finding out if, if, if there is an issue, you don't have to put 25 guys to sift through logs, you actually have you know, automation that does that, that for you. And, and how are you helping? How's VMware helping CSPs here? So we actually have our own OpenStack di distribution that we've been working on for a while now. Uh, of course built on our STDC platform, well integrated into our uh, operational tool set that the uh, VMware admins uh, already know and you know, easy to get started and, and, and use. Uh, and then being built on our platform, it's also very easy to operate, install, and, and, and upgrade. Henrik, thanks for joining us on Telecom TV. Thanks for having me.